Hello, I'm uh, Jim Utaski. I'm a member of the FIRST Board of Directors. I've been involved with FIRST for over 15 years. Today I am at Mount Olive High School where we're celebrating the New Jersey State Championship for FIRST Lego League, one of the four programs that are part of the FIRST continuum for, for all of the K through 12 uh, students. We have Junior FIRST Lego League, FIRST Lego League, FIRST Tech Challenge, which is junior high school and some high schools, and then finally FIRST Robotics. First Lego League. It's actually the biggest and largest program that FIRST has in the world with over uh, 15,000 teams. Um, each year the uh, theme of uh, FIRST Lego League changes. Uh, like Junior FIRST Lego League, the theme is called Body Forward this year and it deals with uh, biomedical engineering. Uh, past ones have dealt with nanotechnology, they've dealt with um, uh, power, puzzle, uh, transportation issues, so they're really world uh, world-based and uh, real uh, issues that the teams have to do research on and they have to do presentations on and uh, to me that's one of the great parts of First Lego League besides building a, a robot that all, autonomously has to accomplish whatever the challenges are on the playing field. Capsize the chemical that makes hot peppers hot. I've heard it's very good at dissolving fat. Yes, the capsaicin penetrates the cell membrane and the vacuole, dissolving the fat and dispersing it in the bloodstream where it can be metabolized by the liver. I'm afraid that's all the time we have for today, folks. Join me tomorrow for more thrilling interviews. Coming up here to Mount Olive off and on for many years now, I'm very excited to see the enthusiasm of the kids. Their imagination is great. They're working with the nanotechnologies. Uh, I, I was pleased to see how many want to go into medicine. I saw model syringe pumps. I saw nanobot technology to cure carcinoid tumors and to, and to work on eye cancers. The kids' imaginations are so important and they're being so stimulated that this is just a great event. garbage you did upon using your body's work as a team to create what is written on a card. Be prepared to show movement. Every team member must be involved in the activity. The team has five minutes to perform the test. Okay. Okay. So far what I've observed here is that um, the students, besides having lots of fun, are very serious uh, about what it is that they are doing. Uh, I've seen uh, boys working together, I've seen boys and girls working together, I've seen leaders emerge from the various groups, and working in a group can, is, uh, is somewhat confining for students, and they're learning at an early age that cooperation uh, is very important. They're very enthusiastic about what they do, they're very committed to what they do, and uh, I think that that's an easy observation to make, and I've made that today. sophistication 
among our students in this effort. Today here at uh, Mount Olive, talking to the young people, I have just shake my head that every year they can be more intelligent, more involved, do more homework, be more inspired by what they're learning. ideas, eye-catching research poster, and explosive team energy. And the award goes to RoboShark. Thank you. 